Hey guys, this is Mayank and today we're gonna learn how to integrate Firebase authentication in our Xcode project. I hope you have already watched my previous tutorial. If not, go back and watch it and come back to this video. So let's start. First to implement authentication, you need to add pod of Firebase authentication in our pod file. So let's do this. Here I've already written the pod firebase slash auth in our pod file just save it go to terminal go to your xcode project path mine is desktop slash firebase app alice to check where i am right now and here is our pod file so just write pod install and install your pod of Firebase authentication. Here it will install the pod. So yeah, there are three dependencies. So we are good to go. The next step is go to a firebase.google.com console. Here we are. So we need to add authentication, then go to setup sign in method. Here we have various sign in methods like Google, Facebook, Twitter, github anonymous and today we're gonna learn how to implement email password authentication so just enable this right here and save go back to your xcode project right here firebase app workspace here i have already taken two text fields and one button to implement email password implementation in our uh, xcode app so let's make the outlets of these text fields and action of this button in our view controller file name it email text field second one is password text field so password text field connect the last one a button here we will make it action and create user and connect so here we have taken login and create user in the common button uh, in practical implementation we used to take login and register on two other views two different views here we have taken on the same view because uh, uh, we wanna do it quickly and i just wanna explain you uh, guys it very quickly so let's do this so create user now here we need to import firebase then we will have to write in our view controller file fire uh, auth dot auth dot create user with email email text field dot text the next one is password text field dot text other one is the completion block here we will add two arguments one is user other is error to handle the error if any and in so here we we'll write if error is not equal to if error is not equal to nil which means if there is any error then print like uh, you can add uh, mm, error and if there is no error then we will implement login over here so we need to add a login function right here in our uh, view controller so go here and add a function name login to perform login operation so right here in login you need to 
at fire auth dot auth dot sign in with email and password email text field dot text other one is password text field dot text firebase is very quick and simple you need to you don't need to do anything that complicated or complex it's very easy here user and error in if error is not equal to nil which means if there is any error just print incorrect incorrect hai bhai otherwise else we'll write print hooray okay so yeah. right here just add the self dot login function yeah, otherwise in else of uh, this create user just add uh, just add this print user has been created and self dot login let's see what is the problem over here user and if I error okay we made a mistake over here let's correct it out so Let's run a project and let's see how it works. This error could be anything. So let's see how our app works. Here I will add myunk dot gmail dot com. No, sorry, myunk at the rate gmail dot com. Password is mmm mmm and just log in and create here our password field should be a secure entry key so let's go back to our go to main dot storyboard go to this and take it secure text entry stop and run this Let's see. Let's uh, myunk at the gmail dot com. This is and login. So let's see what happens in our console. The user has been created and it prints hooray. So here our user has been created and it goes to self dot login and there is no error and it has been it's hooray over here so let's check if the user is again trying to log in from the same account then what will happen login create user there is some error then it goes to hooray 
if I say mayang gmail dot com and click login then say incorrect hai bhai so here we have a two cases in which we try to log in with the new email and password and the other one in which we try to log in with the incorrect email and a password so thanks for now see you in the next one bye bye